Samuel Gadimba and uh, Emily Ngi have just won Kenya their third and fourth uh, gold medals in the ongoing Africa Games. But yesterday it was a tough day in the office for Team Kenya on day two of the athletics action as Ethiopia was victorious in the 800 meters of women's as well as the 10,000 men's uh, race. And uh, Ida Waringa filed uh, this report just after those races uh, came to a conclusion. Day two of athletics here at the African Games. And I must admit, not too good of a day for Kenya. The 10,000 meters men's final has just concluded with Kenya finishing outside of the podium places. Now, first and third, that being a gold and bronze, did go to Ethiopia with Eritrea taking silver. Kenya's Edwin Soy, who is a 2008 Beijing Olympics bronze medalist, taking a fourth and finishing outside of the podium places. <laughs> So they are clearly blaming the fatigue and lack of rest for a lot of the Kenyan athletes here who actually participated in the National Athletics Championships last week. More news from a track and field earlier on in the women's 100 meters final where Kenya's Matsumila Imali finished a seventh and there will be more hope in day three of track and field here in Rabat. Well, the women's 400 meters final will be on with Mary Mora flying Kenya's flag high, hoping that she can give her best and produce a medal in that race. The men's 400 meters as well will be on and so will be the 3,000 meters women's a stipple chase final. Now we did see the 3,000 men's race yesterday produce Kenya's first gold and it's hoped that Kenya will be able to bag the double there winning the men's and the women's race. There will be boxing semi-finals. Kenya being represented by three boxes between the categories of 63 kgs all the way to 91 kgs. So we will be sure to update you on all that and more. I'm Aida Warenga reporting for NTV here in Rabat, Morocco.